In Casey Moe has had one of the most violent years in decades. And tonight, on the longest night of the year, a church in Leewood is holding a special service to remember murder victims. KCTV5's Betsy Webster is live there tonight. Betsy. Well, Ellen, this remembrance is for people not just in Kansas City, Missouri, but throughout the metro. What you see behind me has been out here on the lawn for a week. Each cross bears the name of someone who was killed in the metro. And although each of those people is more than a number, the total number here is significant, too. It is a sobering sight. 190 crosses. Let that sink in. There are almost 200 people who've been killed this year, not from some rare disease, but at the hands of another person. Inside the church tonight, the service intends to provide family members some comfort among others who are dealing with similar emotions and those who are more fortunate but still care. They let you know the people on the other side, I say, in our community, the other side of truth, they care, and they care about all the surrounding counties. They care. They think about it, so no one wants this to happen to them. So how will we stop this? That was Rosalind Temple. Her son was murdered in 2011. At the end of this service, the loved ones will be invited to take the cross with their loved one's name on it, to take home, to remind them of how many people really do care and keep them in their hearts. Live in Kansas City, Missouri, Betsy Webster, KCTV 5 News.